On Monday morning, Sandy Smith arrives at the town city hall, accompanied by Whitney Owen, to resume her work as the town's mayor. And later that morning. Whitney, please answer the door. Of course. Sandy, are you planning to visit the Tuscany Tavern today? I might go there for lunch. Why? No, don't. We just found that someone spray-painted graffiti all over the front of the building and it says, your mayor is a cheater and a slut. Make her resign. Oh no. Why must they do crap like this? Any idea who the vandal might be? No, but it's a safe bet that he is a member of the Faithful Remnant, a religious and political extremist group that has also made threats against suppliers of the restaurant. And this wouldn't be the first time the Tuscany Tavern has been targeted by our enemies, of course. But why would they make graffiti referring to you, Sandy? Well, aside from the fact that I was a co-founder of that restaurant, it must be referring to what Roosh Scumba said about me last week. He's always said bigoted shit about you. Why should this be any different? Because I was caught by Whitney's uncle doing something questionable. I guess you didn't see the actual episode yet, but it is up on YouTube. Sandy then pulls out her smartphone, finds the relevant video, and shows it to Lucy. I see. But that has nothing to do with your work as our town's mayor, does it? What you do on your free time is your business, right? You'd think. Now what? Whitney, get the door again. Hello, I am Charles Christo and I am a reporter for the Dallas Morning News. Do you have any comments about the recent report Roosh Scumba did on you? It's already burning up social media. I have no comment at this time. I'm just trying to do my job as mayor of this town. So I don't need self-righteous assholes getting into my private life. Technically, that's a comment, and a very good one, so I will just get out of your hair right now. Bye. Bad enough they bash me, but they hurt you and your business too, Lucy. I am so sorry. This is my fault. <laughs> Jessica and I aren't blaming you for anything. The vandal committed a crime against our property and he should pay for it. It's Carrie. Mother Lucy, Mother Jessica and I have been going through the footage of the outdoor security cameras at the Tuscany Tavern. And we already found the perp of that spray paint attack. You know who it was. Indeed. Come to the police station so I can show you. Okay. This is the footage taken at about 2 a.m. last night. Recognize her? I do. That's Cindy Everson, the former school board member who was expelled from it after it was revealed she was a member of the board of directors of the Christian Way Academies. She is also a leading member of the Faithful Remnant. Then let's bring her in. Mrs. Everson. We have video footage of you spray painting the outside of the Tuscany Tavern. Even if you thought what Mayor Smith did at the motel was scandalous, that wasn't a crime. But what you did to the restaurant absolutely was. So you are going to jail. No problem. I'll just have myself bailed out and most likely I will be charged a fine or do some community service. But I made my point about the mayor. Yeah, I thought you'd say that. What are you doing here? You know, if you wanted to punish me for what I did with my ex-husband, you could have come after me directly, but like a coward you went after a business I was once associated with and hurt my friends, who had nothing to do with my affair with Steve. So now you and I are going to have a boxing match right here. <laughs> 